Good evening everyone, welcome to the Sugar and Crumbs Kitchen. Let us know that you're here with us this evening on this lovely, still warm, sunny night. So let me just do some intro introductions in the kitchen. So we've got a lovely young lady here called Zoe and every week I've said that she's going to come, well last few weeks I've been announcing she's going to come, never got a name right and I thought she'll put me right tonight and then she's given me the version of her name. We were a long way weren't we Maria? <laughs> so this is Zoe. Kafka. Kafka. <laughs> we've had quack, quack, quacker. Quack. We don't know what we've had. But I do apologise. When you know me well, I'm used oh, to some names. Fine. So I invited Zoe along because she's part of our community group. She's a Sugar and Crumbs follower and she's done these amazing cupcakes. So I'm just going to get the camera over onto the cupcakes and have a look at these bad boys. Give us your thumbs up for them. Are they little beauties or not? Rid of the camera stuff. Yeah. Yeah. So they made mine. What I did on Thursday, rubbish. <laughs> Look at them. Look at them. They're not rubbish. <laughs> so. So they are absolutely amazing, aren't they? Well, Zoe is going to show you how to make them. And I've been watching her tonight and they are fabulous. I can't wait to have a go myself. She's told me I've got to have a go this evening, but it's not happening. Yeah. The show is hers. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just going to say a few other hellos in the kitchen. So we've got Maria in the kitchen who will be running around and under Zoe's nose. And we've no Laura. John is back in the kitchen. Hello, John. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> Don't think he's going to let you see it, but anyhow, he's back in the kitchen tonight. Um, so just a few things to tell you. Laura is on holiday for 10 days, so we have got a Facebook Live tonight. There's no Facebook Live on Thursday, simply because John and I have got an audit and we've got to be in work on Thursday and all next week. We've got a Facebook Live on Monday and I don't think we've got one the following Thursday. So I think for August we may be missing the Facebook Live Monday mornings. But we'll put a post Thursday up. Thursday morning. Thursday mornings, yeah. Sorry, there you go. Got it wrong. I always muck it up. <laughs> so Thursday mornings, every Thursday we'll put a post up or, and Wednesday night as well to let you know whether we're going to do a live or not. But I think September it's going to be out the window. We're just going to stick with Monday nights. So just to show you a new product that's coming, Unicorn Colours by Sugar Flare. Great little set of colours. Can we just pop under there, John? I'm too far back. Yeah, great little set of colours here. So um, let me just open these up. Second. So you get five colours in the tub. So you get this lovely aqua blue, gold, and this is baby pink and daffodil yellow. And then you've got this gorgeous luster. Now this should be eleven ninety nine. We've got it on offer at nine ninety nine. So great value. Definitely get your hands on a set of those. They are in the wish list. So they're on offer, and that's the unicorn set of colours from Sugar Flare. Yeah, pop them on there for you. Anyhow, so that we get on for the evening, let me just tell you about Zoe. Zoe has her own uh, Facebook page, as usually when people do come along, and it's called Single Handed Creations. Now, I've got to be honest, I didn't quite get it at first when I invited Zoe, and then I asked her, and then she said, well, I've only got one hand, and I was a bit dumb. I was like, wow, oh, really? One hand, and you make those amazing cakes? So she does, and it's incredible to watch. You're fantastic, <laughs> aren't you? Thank you. So, she has been a bit shy about it, but let's cheer her along. She's going to show you how to make some absolute beauties. And I'll ask her any questions. You feel free to ask questions as well. And let's keep you talking. Yep. Because she's not shy. Really. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, Zoe. Thank you. Right. Which one are we uh, starting with? Which one are we going to go with? Yeah. Ooh, should we show them? Have we had a look on here, John, again? Yep. So, so what have we got here? We've got the poodle. Yep. Yeah. The pug. The pug. Shih tzu. Shih tzu. These are uh, French, bulldog, French bulldog, yeah, uh, and bulldog. And we're going to make all these, aren't we? Yeah. Should we just make them in order? Yeah. Should we make the poodle first? The poodle, yeah. Yeah. Great. And then the things that she need use tonight is just sugar paste, isn't it? You yeah, just use just sugar, sugar paste, paste direct, don't you? No cutters. Fantastic. Yeah. So show us how it's done. Anyone well, <laughs> can do it. <laughs> Are 
you answering, you shout out questions, John, tonight? I can do, yeah. yeah. So, so, how long have you been decorating, cake decorating? About 20 years. 20 years, I best get over yeah. there so that you can let this camera reach yeah. on. <laughs> 20 years, and what made you go into cake decorating, Zoe? Started off doing flowers. Yeah. I wanted to learn to do flowers, so I did a... Actual real flower decorations or cake decoration flowers? Cake decoration flowers. Yeah. Um, started doing that and then just got into everything else. Well, I wish I'd got into those cakes. So hopefully, so hopefully, get ladies and gents, you're all going to be so impressed with the way these cakes are made. These cake toppers are made. We're going to have loads of them over our community group this week, overrun with little doggies. Yeah. <laughs> right, so just a circle to start with. Cover the top. And I notice you didn't put any buttercream on. Don't need to put buttercream on. No, you don't need to. No? No. Fantastic. You can even use just edible glow or a bit of water if you want. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. You can use the domes as well. Yeah, to give it a bit of a rounder yeah. shape. Yeah. Yeah. But I don't think so with all the detail you've got going on there. You don't need no. that extra shirt, yeah. No. Uh, and then for the nose or the muzzle bit, is it muzzle? Is it a muzzle? Is it a muzzle? John? Sure. Come on, John, clever clocks. I, I, I would have said nose. <laughs> Doggy nose. <laughs> I think it is a muzzle. <laughs> yeah. Start off with a cone and then just flatten one end. Smooth it. Push it on and turn it up a little bit. And where are you based then, Zoe? Sheffield. Sheffield. Yeah. Fantastic. And your cake page is called Single Handed Creations. Cake Creations. Yeah. yeah. Cake Creations. Right. Yeah. Okay then. Yeah. So I do want you to pop over there and like her page. Have a look at some of her goodies later. They're absolutely fantastic. Can I read the comments on here? Can hmm? I read your comments? And then just mark where you want your eyes. Uh, Joe Fitchett says these are great for the dog club. That's how you made them, wasn't I it? I made them for a, um, a dog charity. Yeah, that's how yeah. you came about it, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. And then it's just a matter of rolling different size balls. Jacqueline Penfold says, oh my God, they are brilliant. Janet Brown thought one was a boxer. Yeah. As it could be. <laughs> well, you've got a very good audience tonight, Zoe, just yeah. to put you on the spot. Thanks. <laughs> so just to let you know, Zoe's never been on a live before. She has been nervous, like everybody is when they come in the Sugar and Crumbs kitchen. So if she's a little bit quiet, she'll get talking soon, because believe me, she is a chatterbox. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just start looking for some questions to get her going. So it's just a matter of building up to get the shape. Normally poodles have like a bouffant, don't they? Yeah. yeah. And the sugar paste that so is using tonight is Sugar paste direct, and you've not put any tylo in or anything, no, have you? No. Just nice and soft. Yeah. Sometimes it does stick to itself as well, so you don't need glue or anything. There's always one Julie Crompton. She was hoping you'd do a beagle. Oh. <laughs> All these lovely kids. I'll All have these to practice little one. Yeah. I'll have to practice one. So Annette, Annette says, don't be nervous, Zoe. We're all nice bakers on here. And oh, she's true. Yeah. yeah. If someone's just joined us and wondering what the creation is. So we're actually making the poodle, which is the one in the top left hand corner of your screen now. Oh, yeah. Right. Becky 
Nikki Dunn says, don't be shy, you go girl. I love these learn lives, I'm learning so much. Charlotte Hearn says, they look great, she can't wait to try making them herself. Yeah, everyone needs to try, they're yeah. easy aren't they? Than what you think. And Anne Gallagher is worried about poor Maria, who must be freezing. I must admit, Maria has got a t-shirt on. We are amazed. She has brought a hoodie, though. Yeah, she has, she has got a hoodie. And she made sure John remembered to bring it. She's like, John, he remembered. That's funny there. Helen Louise Neal says it's blooming woofy. I am blooming nice, <laughs> blooming wolfy. <laughs> so all these little balls that you just roll on here, just roll, roll them various sizes? Yeah, whatever, whatever size, yeah. They don't need to be a particular size. I think sometimes if there's too much sugar paste, you can peel it off before you eat the cake as yeah. well. Geraldine, who was on a few weeks ago, um, doing um, cake lace. Now she was really very nervous. So she's just popped on and she said, don't worry Zoe, if I can do it, so can you. Carol's got a great network of supporters, oh. which we do on the Facebook Live here. There's always, yeah. when you watch it yourself, you know, yeah. there's always very people supporting. Ears, head, ears, yep. And then it's just. So Annette's just saying, so when you're attaching everything, you don't use any glue or water. Sometimes you don't need to, but I have used a bit of edible glue, yeah. just on base. Jules Brownhill is one of our admins. They said, what a true inspiration. My mum has left hand paralysis due to a stroke and you've given me the courage to take some of my cake tools round and have a go with her. She'll love it. Definitely needs to. You don't know unless you try. No. No, we've no air con on today, Rob. We're coping. Just a uh, Janet Nurt wants to. Which one is your favourite dog out of the ones that you like making? I like the Shih Tzu. The Shih Tzu. Yeah. So Zoe is going to make all the doggy toppers that you can see here. So there's five, and you're going to have another. You're going to have got another one, are you? Or should, is it one you said we shouldn't talk about? No, we're not talking about that one. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, then, well, we won't talk about the St. Bernard. <laughs> <laughs> she made all these, she's only just made these cakes, you know, an hour before we started. So she came with just plain cupcakes, and then she said, right, I'll just, I'll just do a few now to get going. And then she said, oh, I was thinking of maybe having a go at a St. Bernard, a few requests. Anyhow, we're not allowed to talk about him. No. <laughs> Uh, Becky Dunn says, any tips on making a sheep cake? Sheep cake? Mm. I presume it's what you're doing there with the poodle, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, just exactly the same, yeah. yeah. It's just all little balls, isn't it? Yep. Smallest now. And that's that. And that's the French poodle. He's done, isn't he? Do you want to turn him round to the yeah. camera? Because we're upside down. We're upside down. Perfect. And then tip him over, tip him forward. Is that it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, we've got eyes Perfect. on. Yeah, Obviously do you, you want to just tip it forward that way a bit? Yep, down. That's it. There we go. Wow, right. look at that. How long did that take? In no time. So what do we think of that one? Do we like that one? Who's got a French poodle out there? You don't often see poodles, do you? No, I love poodles. I do. Aren't they cute? Aren't they cute? Right then. Right. Brilliant. So yeah. which of you has got a French poodle? So put that on there, Marie? Yeah. <laughs> oh, they all love it. Absolutely love it. God. Right. Right. Next. Next um, one. Pug. Pug. Absolutely. Pugs are so fashionable now, aren't they? They are, yeah. And you know what? I don't actually think they're that cute. I think they're no. lovely little things. <laughs> My brother's got one and I call it Pugler. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, 
mean, I know they're nice and small and dainty, but I just don't see anything beautiful about them. They're going to make me cry. What? Do you like pugs, Maria? Yeah. Oh, oh God. <laughs> well, <laughs> everyone's throwing up the love hearts in here. They absolutely love it. God. So, Julie Crompton, excellent. Elaine Lawton, love, love. Joe Chaplin, cute. Dara Wheeler, wow, cute. Jacqueline Penfold says, you're so clever, it's super. Janet Brown says, keep going. It'll keep the kids quiet during the holidays when she shows them. Yeah. <laughs> the kids yeah, would they, love making this, actually. Well, That's they, a good yeah. idea, isn't it? Yeah, because they are easy and quick to do, so yeah. they're not going to get bored. Karen Naylor says, you've got six real-life models in the hallway I there. I'm going to take them all over there. <laughs> Alright, I've just lightened that a bit, that brown a bit. So, to lighten the brown, what have you used the... I've just... Mm -hmm. It's a brown colour splash. Yeah. It was the darker one, darker colour. So yeah. I've just mixed oh, that's it a, a bit of white. Yeah. And lightened it a bit. We'll be having requests for all sorts of cakes. We've got a request in for a chinchilla. How many dogs have you got in that picture? A chinchilla? A what? <laughs> what are they called? Chihuahua. A chihuahua. A <laughs> chinchilla is one of those little... <laughs> <laughs> like a dog. <laughs> it's not even a dog, a chinchilla, is it? <laughs> it's a chihuahua. Well, at least it's an animal that does exist. <laughs> What colours? Do you just go through the colours that you've mixed for the pug? Uh, it's just dark brown. Just a dark brown colour splash. Colour splash, yeah. Yeah. So I'll put the colours as she uses them in the wish list because I forgot to put them in. So basically we're using white um, sugar paste, aren't we, from yeah. Sugar Paste Direct and black sugar paste and then you're colouring what you need to colour, yeah. aren't you? This one's a bit darker than that. It just needed a bit more white in that's so. all. And then we've got ready done, ready made. Black sugar paste. Is this sugar paste there yeah. as well? So most things are just either bowls or sausages. Balls or sausages, yeah. yeah. We like balls and sausages. Balls or sausages. <laughs> that could be so another we'll conversation after yeah. nine o'clock, that one. We've got a sausage <laughs> and just thin it out in the middle and then... There are. John's gone wandering now. See what he does? <laughs> <laughs> he leaves it on and then he starts wandering. <laughs> and then just curve it. And I don't know what shape you'd say that is, but... You need to get the camera angles from there sometimes. And just mark where you want your eyes so you've got a guide. Are you calming down now? Are you feeling alright? A little bit. Yeah, just settle in <laughs> and relax. They're all loving it. You've got a fantastic audience tonight. We've got 178 people watching you live. Oh, wow. Yeah. What are you telling me that for? Right? Let's make you feel good. <laughs> How big is your uh, round cutter, Portia? Portia asked. I have so, no idea. I think it's the largest one, that one, is it's it? It's the, the next set? to the largest. Next to the largest, yeah. yeah. They usually come in a set. I have put the sets on the website and it's the second to the largest. I suppose it depends on how big your cupcakes are as well or how big they come out. Yeah. Karen Naylor's laughing at me going chinchilla. <laughs> it's because I can't read, Karen. Just makes 
is false. You're right, Karen, there is nothing in the fridge. I want to just come back from holiday. <laughs> we're, we're making sure we've got now in the fridge, shall we? Someone's asked about the, the, is the black and white one a French Bulldog? It is, or it could be a Boston Terrier. Oh, wow. A two in one. A two in one? Yeah. Yeah. Are you going to do that paw print one as well? I can do it, it's just, yeah, it's not. It may be easy to oh, use Yeah, it? I will do the paw print. <laughs> Just put that on the camera there, Sean. Up. 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 There. Cross. There. Yeah. And we want that paw print one as well, don't we? It may well be easier to Zoe, but it may not be easy to us. <laughs> See how you do it. It's just a circle. Pinched in. Oh, yeah. well, we know when you tell us, aren't yeah. we? That's the secret. Look at that. That's it. See that? Mm-hmm. You could put piping gel on its nose and eyes as well to make them. Yeah, that's a shine. good idea, isn't it? The piping gel makes their eyes a bit more smiley. Yeah. You might think that they're really looking at you then. Yeah. <laughs> it can freak me out a bit. <laughs> a 3D sloth cake. And I thought he needed some extra, so I put piping gel on his eyes. My neighbour thought he were a teddy bear when she came in. <laughs> so Tina's asked, do you know when Dawn will announce the name of the snail from last week? Will it be on her page? That's a very good mm. question, yeah, well, that's a question. Oh, just to give you an update, guys, go and you carry on, Zoe. Right. Just to give you an update, guys, um, John and I went away on Friday for three nights just to get away. We got back at lunchtime this afternoon. We shot straight into work. We've got loads of um, emails and things to answer because I was insistent that we did take some time off this weekend. Um, so I will answer everybody in the morning uh, questions. The Dinky Doodle should have arrived with us on Friday. It did get delayed due to customs um, arriving with Dawn and Dawn has got them and she's posted them to me today. So they're coming by courier today. I'll definitely have them tomorrow and they'll all be shipped out tomorrow. So I'm going to put them all on next day delivery so that they're all out to you. So you'll all get them on Wednesday for everybody who paid for theirs and got the ones that were in stock. Your pre-orders are coming at the end of September. Anybody who ordered stuff with the Dinky Doodle, I have already dispatched, okay? Um, I did say I would only, I would save them, but it, with John and I made the decision to dispatch everything that we could. So do be patient, we're doing everything we can. He's a little cutie, this one. So how are you coping working uh, upside down, Zoe? Um, not very well. <laughs> <laughs> so just before we went live, I said to Zoe, I said, oh, by the way, because she was doing a cake, I said, oh, by the way, you can't do it that way because we can't see it. We want everybody else to see it. So you'll have to turn it round and do it upside down, bless her. <laughs> Lynn said, don't forget my phone call, Carol. Lynn. Feather. Feather. Was there a phone in you, Lynn? <laughs> Forgot it then. Forgot it already. And Amanda has said everyone should make their own dogs and post it. That'd be quite good, wouldn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I need a charger. Yeah. Uh, 
just the ears and then that one's done. Oh look he's so cute isn't he? Have I got names for these? And then um, for the names for the snail, you're quite right actually. That was something that was Dawn was doing. So um, if can somebody message me afterwards or message me now and then um, I'll pop it over to Dawn and see where she's going to announce that. Keep forgetting. What? Not to cut on your board. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, don't be chopping on my green board. <laughs> So just for its ears is just a triangle, flattened triangle. I tell you, you don't have to work them together quick, don't you? They don't take long at all. I'd still be here all day. It took me an hour to do those three little couple of things the other day. Audience is growing. That's that one. There you go. Wow, yeah. look at him. Right, do you want to just tip him forward? Yep. Wow, look at him. Is he a beauty or not? Can we get a bit closer there, John? Just move it over that way. Down a bit. Yep. What do you think, guys? This way. What do you think, guys, of this one? Go on, what is he? Pug. A pug. I know, just pug before I called him a chinchilla or something like that. <laughs> Make sure. He's not Valerie, a fish, Carol. <laughs> Valerie, I have to agree with you. How amazing. Just tip him forward. Yay. Look at that. Down a bit. There you go. <laughs> there, everyone loves that. Isn't that lovely? No, Rob, we've managed to keep John out of the fridge because there's nothing in there. He's devastated. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely love that one. Very good. Fabulous. So uh, Carl says, do you have any cat designs? Not at the minute. Not at the minute. That's coming next. <laughs> She'll be practicing them for our next session. So that's that one. We've got a pug. So which one are we going to do next then? Uh, this is a Shih Tzu. So should we do that one? Yeah. Should we do a Shih Tzu. So which ones have you just pointed out on the... That's this one. Okay. So we've done the French Poodle, the pug. We can do the Shih Tzu now. Yep. Are you going to do one, Carol? No, I'm here. Why? <laughs> and what's this one? Uh, what is it? A French bulldog. French bulldog. Yeah, I think French bulldog. Oh, man, I knew the name. Or a Boston Terrier. Oh, it yeah, says on right, the yeah, internet. Yeah. They're so cute, though, aren't they? Yep. Just rinse the hands. So, no cats tonight. It's dog night tonight. Absolutely love them. Dory Frost, Pugalicious. Pugalicious. I like that, Pugalicious. Yeah. Sue Simpson, pugs. loving the pulp cakes. Doreen Griffin loves them. Gillian, Jacqueline, Di Wheeler, Maxine. Oh, my granddaughter Ella is watching from Australia. Uh -huh. Hi, Ella. Ella, you'll have to give these a go, love. You'll love watching these. So make sure you have a go with these, babe. Catherine, you can go back and watch your poodle. Don't worry, Maria is filming everything. One little minute videos will be flying around this week. So Maria, you have missed them making the French poodle and the um, pug. pug. And the pug. And now we're doing the... Uh, shih tzu. Yeah, I'm not saying any more names yeah. anymore. In case I get them wrong. <laughs> Do the cupcake cakes have buttercream under the icing? No, they don't, but that doesn't mean you can't put buttercream on them. Um, Zoe's only just using the cupcakes just as a base, so of course, of course, put buttercream on or a bit of jam, whatever you want to put on underneath before you put your topping on. But Zoe's just putting them on like this just to show you. Otherwise, we'll have everyone mithering us how to make buttercream. Yeah. <laughs> 
Right, Lindsay McIver says, right, go on, Carol. I've got to do a Lincoln, Poppy, Daisy, Barney and Chip and a Basil. Basil, you forgot, Lindsay. <laughs> These dogs do like Zoe. They've come in, they must know what she was doing tonight. <laughs> So Jane, I don't know who the winner is for the snail competition. To be fair, I completely forgot about it. And there's a competition done by Dawn. And I will message her now to see what she's been doing about it. You answer, you shout the questions. Mm -hmm. So we've got John in the kitchen tonight. He's not been here for a while. with this one if you just keep putting your lines in as you go in and then you don't lose them when you put more sugar paste on top and it doesn't matter about this being middle because that gets covered up but this one is just teardrops teardrops balls and sausages I tell you we're getting nearer to nine, aren't we? <laughs> eh? Wonder what's going after after that then. <laughs> so my granddaughter is in Australia. It's five a.m. in the morning, and she's here watching. She so oh. said they look amazing. Oh. Julie Haig is giving hi, John. Hello, Julie. And did we have a nice holiday, Catherine? Yes, we did. We had a nice break. Spent it with my daughter and grandchildren. So this one doesn't look like much until you get his eyes and stuff on. But it's so simple, the effect there, isn't it? When you yeah. put it together, see, I, I just thought they were so difficult, but watching you put them together is just so easy. Yeah. And you don't need cutters or anything, so you can just, the way you go and done. Carol, can't you? Yeah, absolutely. You can. I don't know whether <laughs> I can. <laughs> Everyone can. So Jean, um, Zoe is on tonight from Single Handed Creations and she's making um, dog cupcake toppers. She's got five different designs to make and we're on design number three. And Judy Cam. Crompton says, what camera are we on, John? This is, when I'm there, when John, when John is here in the kitchen, he's not in the fridge, I'm usually going, what camera are we on, John? John, <laughs> John. That's my big hint to get John back to the camera. Right, so now we just need his eyes and his nose to make him look a bit more lifelike. Mm -hmm. Deborah Hayes said these would be great for brownies and guys group, even the rainbows with a little bit of help. It's good that, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, they are easy. That's why I like them. Can we call the chips, chips to Barry? What's that say, John? Can we call the Shitsu Barry? Oh, can we call the Shitsu Barry? Right. <laughs> If you like to leave, yeah. Is that, can. Refer, is that referring to somebody you know called Barry? <laughs> <laughs> so Laura Jane Thomas Lomas, is she a friend of yours? Yeah. She said, "Hi, so are you doing a great job? And make sure you bring us some home." <laughs> <laughs> Laura's my cousin. Oh, is she? Yeah. yeah. Right, Dawn Butler is watching. I have messaged her. Hi, Dawn. Sorry, what did you say? She has responded. Oh, wish. Is she message in messenger? She responded. Yeah. The question there is it modeling paste that you're using, Zoe? No, it's just sugar paste. Sugar oh, sure. paste direct. Yeah, it's just normal sugar paste. 
and we're using sugar paste direct tonight with no tylo nothing it's just because it's just so nice and easy to yeah. roll isn't it yeah. that's why yeah so it's just nice and easy for us to roll out so dale uh, dale john wants to know if you've got a new contract no i'm pleased to say i haven't no We've not told Laura, but we might take her on for another year. <laughs> but you've not told her yet. <laughs> no, we've not told her yet. She's in Turkey. Don't think she'll be watching. <laughs> Karen Naylor says she's got a, fr a few friends who work for work and volunteer for the Dogs Trust, and these would be fabulous yeah. for one of their charity days. That's what got you doing it, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. From Dawn has put on the... She's watching and will be choosing the winner of the snail naming contest soon. Yeah. She's going to have to go and find the post where they all are. Well, just I'll just win then and then it saves her having to miss about looking at posts, <laughs> doesn't it? That snail was fabulous. And then two more sausages for the eyebrows. So Maxine says, we're all looking nice and cool, but is the pace getting sticky? But it isn't though, is it? Not really, no. no. It actually is quite pleasant in the kitchen tonight, hasn't it? I have to tell you, I've been to Mallorca this weekend and it was touching 40 this weekend. We were dying. We couldn't do anything. Couldn't even just walk into the pool was, was exhausting. Um, Annette, we like the Sugar Paste Direct. We sell Massa as well. Um, we do sell Massa to Zeno. We sell it in 250 gram blocks, a kilo, five kilos and seven kilos. So we do do, do them, but it's very expensive, a lot more expensive than the Sugar Paste Direct. And you know, we like it and it's working very well for these models. So Julie says, John, can you do a bit more of a close up? That means John has to do a bit of work. Come on, John. Where do we need, where do we need Zoe? We just need to move, that's it. That's, that's it. Yeah, it. Perfect. And then John can zoom in then, what you're doing. So I'll just the lines for the fur. And then the ears are just two more flattened sausages. That's what it's all about, sausages and bones. What else have we got? <laughs> so you added a third component before. Um, Teardrops. Teardrops, yeah, there That's you go. It. So we've got sausages, balls, and teardrops. Yep. That looks fantastic, Zoe. They really do look really very good. And, and no disrespect, you make it look so simple. Just, I mean, you've got one hand and you're all doing that. Yeah. And then us lot with two arms would be sat here moaning saying we can't do it. <laughs> it just looks fantastic. They look so cute. So how many are you can eat, Maria? Mm -hmm. Which one have you got your eyes on? <laughs> Which one did she request before? The French bulldog. Are you gonna eat a French bulldog? It's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> this one just finishes it off when you put the ears on. Yeah. Pulls it together, doesn't it? Yeah. And then just some more. Got a bit of work in there. Don't worry. You're doing a great job, honestly. Are you still nervous? Yeah, I'm shaking. <laughs> I'm trying not to talk common Yorkshire. I'm, I'm trying my hardest to get you to talk, girl. <laughs> uh, Julie Crompton says that she loves this one and you could make this one into a beagle. So she could actually. Yeah, you yeah. could. Yeah. Not, as more, not as many lines on it. Mm. Yeah. And that's that one. Janet, say, Janet says that one looks like our spot. So she's got a dog that looks like that. Oh. You're doing a great job and we're all watching. That, yeah. that way. Lovely, thank you. Absolutely fab. So let me pose there. Uh, zoom in. So that one's spot. 
is called Spot. Mm, That's you. really very cute. Absolutely amazing. Well done. Let's get those loves arts up again. Amazing. Everybody just loves them. You just need some whites in his eyes. Do you want to challenge you? Okay, I'll put you some gloves there as well. So cute. So aren't we just loving these? Who's going to give these a go? And you don't even need much. You just need some sugar paste, guys. That's it. Sugar I'm rolling paste. it. Look, she's just showing you. We're not even selling you any tools tonight. We're only selling you sugar paste. I'm doing rubbish, aren't I? I should be selling things. <laughs> we should be hot on sales tonight. <laughs> Our big wish list. <laughs> <laughs> there wasn't a lot in it. <laughs> You can use Saraceno if you want, but Saraceno is more expensive and a bit harder. So that's modeling paste. And then Zoe wants to use the sugar paste because it's a lot softer to roll. So, and it's easier for kids. Than, yeah, I was going to say it is easier yeah, for kids. Yeah, it's a lot easier. Yeah. So, can you point out which one we're doing this time, please? Yeah. So Helen Louise O'Neill says there's nowt wrong with common Yorkshire, so you're doing a great job. I can't help it, I can't hide it, so <laughs> embrace it. Don't hide it. <laughs> yeah, so it's the... Should we bring him round? Bulldog one. Yeah. Is it an English bulldog? No. British know. bulldog. Yeah. I think it is. Go on, bring him round. Bring him round. So we're going to make this one. This one's a lovely, isn't it? Well, they're all lovely. I don't know why I'm saying this one's lovely. He's cute, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And that's the first time I've made that one. Yes. Tonight. That was it. Yes, yeah, she it's the first time she made this one tonight. She did say. Hi Martin. So this one is nude colour splash. Yeah. yeah. So this is the white sugar paste and we've just coloured it with the nude colour in. Do you want to just show them the colour in? Yeah. So you just use the nude colour in just a little bit, isn't it? Just yeah, drop not a lot at all. To give it a nice skin tone look. Yeah. I might need to mix some more actually. Yeah, I think you're going to need more than that, yeah. aren't you? Just do the... And Catherine, it's not a pour cutter. She's going to show you at the end. She just made it by hand. Bev Thomas said she'd love to know if you could do a Jack Russell. Jack Russell. <laughs> <laughs> I think they're just more distinctive when they've got Bigger yeah. features, you yeah. know what they are, I think don't so, you? Yeah. yeah. So come on, guys, tell me who's going to give this a go this week? Who's going to be on this tomorrow? I'll just I know you all will be. And when Maria's done those little videos, how many are you going to make, Maria? Five little videos, one of each one. Yes. Good girl. Becky May says they are adorable. I love them all. You've done a great job on them. And it's a shame to eat them it is. because they are too cute. I don't think I would eat all the sugar paste on them. No. <laughs> no. Well, you could run home to Sheffield yeah. after you get that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all that energy. You don't need to drive. If I just said a bit more nude. Catherine's going to go. That one. Oh, I said hello to Martin and it's Jane, his wife, on Martin's account. <laughs> Hi, Jane. Oh, they're over from Sheffield Way, so they said it's a great accent. Charlotte Hearn will. Sue Clark's going to give them a try. Joe Fitchett's going to going to give them a go with a grandson. Yeah, kids would definitely love them. Yeah, they will. And they'll have to post pictures of their own what they've made up rather than copying. Absolutely, them, yeah, so. absolutely. You should all get adventurous. I thought Pam had come in and said that she'd lost ten, uh, nine stones. So Pam says she's late. She's been to Swimming World and reached her target. Slimming World. That's what I said, Slimming World. You said Swimming, swimming world. world. Did I say Swimming World? Sorry, I've got a slur. <laughs> oh I've got that Yorkshire accent going in. It's <laughs> catchy. <laughs> well done, Pam. Yeah, all the requests are coming in now. Can you do a Yorkie? No, we want you to do a Rhodesian Ridgeback yeah. and a fat basil. A fat basil. <laughs> <laughs> you will have to do one, Carol. Eh? Uh, no. You'll have to do that. I'll, get, I'll give one when no one's looking. I get put under enough trauma here on Mondays and Thursdays. <laughs> glad to hand it over to somebody else. Can you lower the camera, please, John? Right, I 
another sausage. And then I was saying they can't see. John, was you was you nosing somewhere else? Had you forgot your camera work? We're getting people saying they can't see, John. But we're back on, though. We're back on. Sorry, John was just daydreaming for a, for a moment. <laughs> Dreaming of when he doesn't have to do cameras again. <laughs> Mouth, which you just put on first, just build it up. Hey, we might be having our shortest Monday session. Look at this, nearly done. All right, <laughs> nearly done. Crikey, everybody won't know what to do with themselves <laughs> for another hour. <laughs> Do, yeah, I know. <laughs> Maxine's going to give these a try with her grandson this weekend. So's Irish Shuttleworth. Do they think they're easier to do than what they actually are? Yeah, yeah. Are you all surprised at how easy they are to do? Because I've got to be honest, I thought they were really hard. Are you all surprised? Sue Wright says, tell Zoe, Sue says hi, and go girl, go. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Did we get it on the wrong camera with the hand in there? Kat Riley's laughing. She said, I bet that was Laura's plan to go on holiday just before a contract up and then John will be begging for her to stay another year. <laughs> to be fair, we actually like Laura. <laughs> More than you. More than you. Go on, Maria, you go on. Hit John between the eyes, go on. You hear what she said to John there? More than you. Go on, you punch him in the eye there. Yeah, that's it. I'm pleased to hear that actually. <laughs> and that says you're flying through them and you make it look so easy. It is easy. John, stop bit. walking around facing <laughs> about. Dog can have that bit. <laughs> That's that dog shell. I agree with you, Karen. Laura and Maria are lovely. We're keeping them. Maria's not got a passport back yet. <laughs> <laughs> just lines in his forehead. Around his eyes. Rain Stevenson's going to give them a go. Good, and we're looking forward to it. To yeah. it, watching everybody give them a go. Andrea and Ethan are watching. That's so, my friend who I was telling yeah. you about earlier. Andrea and Ethan are watching, and they want a bun when they get back. When you get back, <laughs> <laughs> we're all staying here. For oh, it's dogs. good. Yeah, it's good, to, <laughs> it's good to see your friends join. Yeah. And Sherry, Sherry Shingler is going to try these with her primary school baking group. Oh, that'd be brilliant. good, wouldn't it? That'd yeah. be great for the kids at school. Can you imagine them taking them home? They'd be great. Yeah, that's brilliant, that. So we're going to get you to go back practice cats next. Right. <laughs> you a good girl remembering to chop on the board isn't she good there remembering not to chop on my green board yeah. so 
saw that evil look in your eyes that were warning <laughs> there before I did it. <laughs> And your sister-in-law's watching. Rachel. Is she? Yeah. Well, they're all at She's it, aren't they? In Cornwall. Yeah. What are you doing? Watching Should you. Be on beach. Yeah. <laughs> watching you in Cornwall. <laughs> oh, we've got requests for squirrels now. <laughs> Going a bit far now, aren't they? <laughs> we've got Palvi, who's based here in the UK, but she's in Detroit watching. Oh wow. Yeah. This is a good thing about the lives. You can't, you can't miss us on a Monday, can you guys? Hey, you're all very good. You come over every Monday to watch us. They're as good as gold. Another teardrop shape. He looks so cute. I love those eyebrows on him, don't you? They're great, aren't they? I think Zoe's doing a good job to show you as much as she can. It's very hard trying to make a model backwards, isn't it? When you stood behind it trying to show everyone. And this is the second one you've made tonight, isn't it? First one you only made earlier, didn't you? Yeah. This is why Zoe's doing full concentration. Yeah. Janet says he does look rather grumpy. He does. <laughs> Very grumpy. <laughs> and then just his teeth. Which are another teardrop. Yeah, I'm good That's at that. that one. Yeah, show him to the camera. Got him on there, down a bit. John, have you stopped talking? Mm -hmm. Yeah, down a bit. <laughs> just a bit further, That's further, it. further. Nearer the purple lovely. thing. Absolutely lovely. So just stay there. We're we'll just trying to. If you come a bit further down to where the purple is, let's see if we can stretch him in a minute. Let me just go back that way. Right, up a bit now. There we go. There we go. What do you think of him? What we're going to call them? Have you got names for these boys? No. Is any of them girls? I always call them Key. <laughs> They're all boys. Isn't it funny, isn't it? I yeah. always call everything girls. Yeah. <laughs> well, they absolutely love that. Beautiful. Really lovely. Fantastic. And then it's just there. And we've got the last one in the paw. Yeah. The you made that look so easy, Zoe. You know what, this is the first time Zoe did one. The one that was on the tray is the first time she did that one tonight. And she thought she'd give it a go. And then the second one, that's just, you just made that look so good. So easy, they absolutely love it. You've got your nephew Oliver watching as well. All right. Julie says he looks like that dog off Tom and Jerry. He does, what's oh, he called yeah. him off Tom and Jerry? Brutus. What's he called? Brutus. Brutus, is that what he's called? Yeah, he does I'm look sure like him, Brutus. doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah, hey, well done, Julie. Yeah. So that one's Brutus. <laughs> I absolutely love it. So this one's mostly black. Right, are we on the camera now?
So we've just covered the cupcake in black. And then he just says a strap down his head, which is another sausage. Flat and We're after nine now, you can say what you like. Oh! <laughs> Central and just back a bit, perfect. Yeah. yeah, yes. Everyone tends to drift. Yeah, I know. I, I always <laughs> put it left hand side. We all do it, we all end up going off yeah. camera. And the thing is, when you're watching from the other side and you've watched from the other side, it looks like, right, why are you not in the camera? But now you're here in the kitchen, you can see, yeah. can't you? Yeah, it's too easy to pull it towards yourself, isn't it? It is, yeah. So you've done the flat base and just a white sausage now. Yeah, and this one's, I don't know, like a kidney bean shape, yeah. is it? And then just evading it all. Again. We can speak up so we've got quite bodily eyes this <laughs> one, so... Are you concentrating on them? Do you want yeah. to bring them round? No, it's alright. Yeah. He's got a nice big snout there, hasn't he? Yeah. Not always, if I'm making two of something, yeah. make a big one and then cut it off and then you know it's sort of similar size. Right, yeah. The bone crack. I'm moving the camera to follow you. <laughs> <laughs> Might be easier. Yeah. <laughs> we'll just follow you around. <laughs> See, it was great in the days when John used to just have one camera and he had to follow around. So, um, but those days are over now. His back can't take it anymore. And a bit of white in his eyes. Uh, yes. <laughs> Just played the live there. So they want you back. So they said, you've got to come back because there's more dog breeds than there are cats and squirrels. Yep. <laughs> so we need more dogs. They're all lovely to hear your John's Irish accent back in the kitchen. I think John should have his own fan club. Right. <laughs> He's shy, really. Me and Carl on the same side of the camera. We wouldn't fit, <laughs> would we? <laughs> and then this one, he's got uh, black 
So I've just used Black Colour Splash. And a drop of Rejuvenator. I'm really enjoying this uh, demo tonight. And then just his ears. Oh, well, here we go. We've got Leslie now. She wants. She's on. After you've done dogs, cats, squirrels, can you do farm farm animals and zoo animals? <laughs> I think that might be easier <laughs> than cats. <laughs> and Karen Naylor says, "Like hell is shy." <laughs> <laughs> you know him too well, Karen. <laughs> Just another teardrop, flattened teardrop. And Louisa Johnstone yeah. says, wow, so clever. And how many more animals can be made? Joe Fitchett, elephants. Yeah. And elephants. Sausages. And, <laughs> and Dale Clark Blackler says, no mess tonight, you're amazing. I'll tell you what, you've knocked out a few cupcakes here in just over an hour. It took me an hour to do those free cake toppers the other day. <laughs> To be honest though, when I did do the first lot, it did take me a while. Three hours. Did it? Yeah. yeah. They don't take you three hours now, do they? No. I know when Just... you came in tonight and you hadn't made any, Maria says, Carol, what's your time? <laughs> <laughs> it's a touch of glue again. These might not stay on. Down a bit on the camera, let's see. Just not you, just me. Oh look, you know it's amazing, you put those little pointy ears on, doesn't that bring it together? Yeah. Wow, wow. look at him. Wow, look at that. <laughs> Isn't he a cutie? Come on then, everybody. What do we think of our little French bulldog? I don't even know why I'm saying he's a cutie. They're not cute, are they? <laughs> Maria. <laughs> Is that your favourite dog, Maria? Yeah. <laughs> How can you betray our Basil, Poppy and Daisy? What's this one called, <laughs> then, Maria? You can name this one. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Manuel. Manuel. <laughs> <laughs> so that's that one. Absolutely fabulous. So what do we think, guys? Look at that. Do we want her to do the paw now? Hey, she's got to do the paw. She may as well finish it off. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant, Zoe. So I've not. I need a. Have you got a smaller circle cutter? Uh, no. Right, I could no. just. I'll just cut one You'll out. Have to just cut one yeah. out. Yeah. Do a big paw. Do a big paw. See what I have got. Yeah. I use this. Would that um, would that be too small? No, that's fine. Yeah. Thank you. Improvise. That's what I like. When when we're in our new sugar and crumbs kitchen, everything will be tanned. Yeah. Lynn Peters says they're brilliant. Jill Sansom, brilliant. 
uh, Jean Blythman, incredible, Louisa Johnstone, absolutely wonderful. They are, aren't they, everybody? Aren't they absolutely fantastic? And that's why I said, when I saw them, I said, you know what, we've got to get her on. Pam loves it how you've even got the eyes in the opposite direction. Is that yeah. how pugs are? Do um, they look the wrong way, pugs? The so French they're... bulldog. Yeah, the French bulldog. Yeah. Goggly eyes, yeah. yeah. That's probably why I don't like them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't know who they're looking at. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody loves them. Right. So, got a bit of black in this. Don't worry. So it's a bit marbled, this one. <laughs> yeah. So, we're going to do a pour now. They'll all be able to do pours. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> They'll all be able to do those. Di Wheeler says that you're amazing and so clever. Oh. In fact, everyone just absolutely loves that them. Tears. Tears. <laughs> I'll yeah. be crying when I'm reading no, you do things good. back. So don't forget, when we finish this live, pop over to Zoe's cake page, like her page, and then you can follow whatever else that she's making. I've got a bride and groom wearing Sheffield Wednesday shirts to do. What have you got? A bride and groom? Bride and groom. Oh, a bride and groom. Yeah. Yeah. I did one last week wearing boxing gloves. Yeah. <laughs> April says her sister's got a French bulldog and she's lovely. She makes a noise like sweet from sooty and sweet. Drives her sister nuts. Charlotte Hearn, she's already liked your page and she says you're fabulous. Fantastic. Jacqueline Penfold, Penfold, they're amazing. I might get up to more than 500 likes ah, then. Ah, yeah, there you go. We've got to try and get to 500 likes. So when we finish, make sure you go over and like our page. What's her cake page again? Come on, Zoe. Single handed cake creations. Single handed cake creations. So it's just a smaller circle. Well, you've got 481 people following you now. Ooh. She wants to get to 500, so all of you. There's 120 here, come on. And it's just pinching. The edges. Can you see this? I mean, right? No. 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 It needs to be down. Yes, there. Yeah. Right. So it's just pinching two edges. And You're going up again. There, Come actually. down again. Yeah. Yeah. And then again, in towards your cupcake. That's it. Yeah. yeah there. That's so it's right. just pinching that bit. Yeah. And then the opposite bit. It just needs to go up. And then back to balls. Back to balls, there back we go. How many balls do we need? Four More balls. than two? Four balls. Four balls. There you go, we like four balls. <laughs> Jackie Richards says, so is Fab and you'll certainly have 500 by tomorrow. Brilliant. Thank you, Kat. Kat's put the link on. So is Robert. Oh, brilliant. And that's been over and just liked your page. Well done. How long have you had your page for? Uh, nearly two years, I think. Right, yeah. Takes time, doesn't it? Yeah. And that's it. Messy that one bit. That's the pot. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're up. You're up to four hundred and ninety-two. Oh. <laughs> Russell Pinder says he's very proud of their niece. 
Oh, but your uncle? Yeah. Is he watching with me now? Yeah. Louisa from America. Louisa Johnstone from America. She's like your page. Well, I think Louisa from Australia. Australia. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, Louisa. <laughs> Australia. So you've even got the following you, the other side of the world. Wow, that looks cute, doesn't it? Have we got it on? Now, uh, to be fair, I've got two versions here. I'm watching the live one, and then I'm watching mine, which is 30 seconds behind. So we'll just carry on with this a minute. So I'll just stay there. Because everybody at the moment are up to there. Right. Because when you do the live, we're always 30 seconds behind. Right, do you want to hold that then? Mm -hmm. So give it, give Zoe a round of applause. Let's get everything back together again then. So I'm going to pull them all on here for yeah. it. So let's get them all in. And let's do a little close up of all these. So I'll get John to tell me on the camera. So right, we only need four more followers to get to 500. Oh, that's go. fantastic. Right, are we on here, John? Yes. Have we got all of them on? Are we in the right place? Mm -hmm. So the, this one here, you can see where we are. Are we on the camera? Which camera right, just, just the, you need to put this them camera? You need to put them in front of the... Wait, of, do you think you have camera? Ah, Should we do this one? Yes. Down. Yeah, down, down, down. And in the, to the that way bit. That's it. Perfect. And this one is shih tzu. This one's the shih tzu. So can you see here the detail where she's put the ears on? Down a bit, Carol. Sorry. Now we got yeah. you. Do I need to be touching this one's nose? Yeah. Right. So you can That's see where she's eye. just scraped it along with a Dresden tool. So if any of you got a Dresden tool, this is what it looks like. Use it for everything. Yeah. To be fair, well used. Oh, you know? 503. Oh, Yay, wow. Congratulations. Fantastic. So, everybody I know who does cake decorating, all the professionals that come here, they say this is their most used Definitely, tool. Yeah. And it's great for just like pushing things into place, yeah. scraping down. What did you do the holes with? Did you do the holes with that? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. And you can just push things into place there. So, the Dresden tool, this is a yellow one. We do them by PME, they're in black and FMM cutters, we have them off them as well. So this one is the Shih Tzu. I, I have, a, I have a, a one second memory. <laughs> <laughs> and then this Should one. Be getting better then. Puglet. Puglet, oh, and they are, we've got it in a slightly different color. Look. So do we like those? Got Maria waving at me, low enough. They look good in the two different colors, don't they? How lovely are them? So just even do it all black as well because they have yeah, all yeah, black ones. All black well, ones, yeah, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. So how lovely are them? Are we loving them? Any response, John? Yes, all very positive. Yeah. Good. And then we've got the French poodles. Let's give you a close-up of these. To me, this one looked like the easiest one to do. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, was it the easiest yeah. one? Yeah. So this is your French poodle. And I have to agree with Zoe, I think this one was the easiest one. And somebody who said about doing a sheet before, I think you could do the sheet with yeah. this quite easily, yeah. couldn't you? Yeah, I have yeah. made small sheet yeah. before, but not a full cake. Yeah, and look how he's got his long snout, and she even put a little mouth in there underneath. Can you see? Can you look at his nose? <laughs> there we go. So we'll just put that one there. And then, so I don't knock his ear off there. And then we've got the French Bulldog. Oh, just make sure I don't knock his ear off. Is that low enough? Might knock his ear off. Oh, I am going to knock his ear off. Have we got him on? Lower? Move that cake out the way there, Zoe. <laughs> <laughs> that one. Yay! Got him? How cute is he? So I'm expecting to see these on our page, on our community group. If you're not a member of the community group, pop on, pop over and search for Sugar and Crumbs All About Cake Community Group and start making these and then tag Zoe in, let her yeah, know that you followed her. These are her little creations. She's made these herself. Do give her credit if you follow her. 
let everybody know that it was from this Facebook Live and it was Zoe who showed you how to make them. Yeah, there we go. And then the last one was the paw. That's the easiest one to do. There, let me move the pug out of the way. Yeah, there's the <laughs> paw, there we go. So we've got that one there. So wasn't that fantastic? Brilliant. An hour and a half, and that's me talking, really. Yeah. So, we're we done. <laughs> <laughs> so, brilliant. Thank you for joining us tonight. It's been absolutely fantastic. Have you, have you got over your nerves yet? I have, yeah. Are you I sure? just need to talk more. Are you going to go? <laughs> she does. When we, when we disconnected for a while, she got a little telling off. Talk more, so yeah. So <laughs> I need to explain. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. But are you going to come back? If you like me. Absolutely. Do yeah. we want to back? Yeah, absolutely we'll, do, yeah. we'll be wanting her back won't we absolutely brilliant demo well done zoe really very very Thank pleased you, you couldn't me. have made it look any any easier maria will be doing six little videos now because we've got the paw to do as well yeah so we'll have six little videos done i don't know when she'll get them done but some of them will be done this week if not all of them oh she's not done her head she's yeah. feeling positive <laughs> Tomorrow, she said, could we keep her out of the warehouse? So she wants to have a full day on her computer, so maybe we might get them all done. Yeah, look at that, her eyes are shining. <laughs> <laughs> so I just want to say thank you for joining us. Please like and share this page. Please pop over and um, like Zoe's page as well, and share it as well. Yeah. So Single-Handed Creations, lovely lady Zoe from Sheffield, and um, really very pleased that you joined us tonight. We're not here on Thursday. We're back next Monday. Now, I've just got to confirm the lady who's coming over. I've been trying to get a hold of her, so I don't know whether she's away on holiday. If she's not here, it looks like it's Zoe again. Oh. So <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, <researching> cats. <laughs> Otherwise, I'll be filling in, but you never know. But hopefully, the young lady who's booked into next week will be here i'm going to get hold of us tomorrow and uh, just confirm everything and we'll put the banner up then but until then please like and share and uh, join the community group and we'll see you next monday at eight o'clock thank you for joining us thank you john thank you maria and thank you zoe thank you